John, thank you. Boy, gotta love postseason hockey and the walleye getting set for their second round playoff series. Yeah, that's right. WTOL 11 sports anchor Chase Bachman joins us live in studio to preview the upcoming game. So, Chase, how's the team looking going into this? Well, Mel, Dan, the team is looking great right now. They're in a great position, and they're getting ready for their divisional final series with Wheeling. And Toledo has a lot of things going in their favor right now. The Walleye are coming off a four-game sweep of their last opponent in Kalamazoo. That sweep, part of an 18-game win streak that goes all the way back to March 13th. Still, this series is not a foregone conclusion. Toledo head coach Pat Mickish says the team has shown some great energy and looks forward to seeing the team get back on the ice. Yeah, it's been a long week getting ready for it. Uh, you know, normally in the playoffs you'll have a quicker turnaround, but uh, getting our job done so quickly over in Kalamazoo gave us a long week, but it was a productive week. I, I loved our energy, and that's the most important thing, that they're excited to be at the rink every day and taking care of their bodies and preparing for these uh, next two games here at, at the Huntington Center. Well, I, the big thing with them, uh, their depth matches up with ours. Uh, they're playing great hockey right now. Their special teams were very sharp in that last series, and and then they're, uh, you know, some of the key players that they've gotten back are healthy and, and playing well. And so game one is set. Puck drop scheduled for 7-15 tonight. We'll have coverage of the game on WTOL 11 News at 11. Tomorrow, we'll have coverage of game two before the series travels to Wheeling for the last games three and four. Reporting live in studio, Chase Bachman, WTOL 11.